Hi, my name is Gisbeel de Beek and I was, we were discussing how to do test-driven development and I will discuss this exercise now. Um, to develop the function is old in Python using test-driven development uh, where we need to create a GitHub repository called is old, share the URL of that repository with people, develop the function is old in test-driven development fashion, and try to be exemplary so you can see that each commit has a nice um, next step that you really follow the TDD cycle step by step and then taking a look at the repository history. What I'm going to do this time is because this exercise builds upon exercise one is even. Is even and is old. Um, those are very similar exercises. So what I'm going to do with is old, I'm not going to develop it from scratch. I'm going to use the code from is even uh, as well. I'm just going to copy paste it ruthlessly uh, to see if um, if we can get the same results. So the first thing is to make a repository call called is old. So is old. Um, well, I didn't, I, I didn't. Let's make it. So you click on the plus, create repository. I call it is old. Is old. It's a bit short name usually, but um, for this video it's fine. I'm going to add a readme. I like to use a Python git ignore file so I'm sure that uh, I don't store things that I shouldn't store without thinking. I like to add a license but you don't need to. I like pub uh, public licenses. Um, so that's what I did. There is my repository. So I created this git repository of is old. This is the uh, URL I should f share with my teachers or people. And now we're going to develop this function called is old. So to get that, to do that, we need to download this repository. Um, I'm going to just copy paste the URL here. And I'm going to take a look at the terminal, git clone that URL. And now is old is on my, uh, is, is on my computer. What I'm going to do is I'm going to copy from is even the code I have already to the is old um, repository. Uh, let's take a look how that looks like main.py. So this is the whole function. Determines if a function is even, does some checks. Well, that looks good. So I'm going to check it in. Uh, add code from is even. I'm going to do a git push. So now I have a bit of a head start. Let's take a look at the repository. Is old, so there's the code for main. And there we already have our function is even. We're going to use that function. Let's use Visual Studio Code to open up that file. Um, so I'm going to close open file. So we're working on is old now. Is old. And we're going to run this file and, and see if it, if, it, if it actually works fine. So we're going to run the current Python file. And this will work perfectly fine because I, well, I just verified it was great. So to develop a function called is old, let's say I'm just ruthlessly uh, copy paste this. I'm going to replace the word even by old and old by even. And instead I'm going to return not is even of x. So it should be the opposite of uh, because a number is uh, is if a number is even means it's not odd. If it's not odd, it's even the other way around. So I can just do this. If we do this shortcut, which is quite reasonable to do, let's see if we can now break the code. Maybe we're already done. So let's assert that is odd has documentation. So we're going to run. Um, we're going to run here. Run a debug. So that doesn't break the code. Let's see if we can make it throw the same exceptions for is odd. Let's run it again. So normally you would delete all those tests instead of just copy pasting them and leaving them be. Um, 
but well if I do a ruthless copy paste on this old then I can might as well do a ruthless copy paste on uh, the tests as well assert is old too that will be false so let's assert not is old too run and debug yeah so in all cases now um, we could not break the code so if you would be very strict you would just delete all code here it does make sense however to show people you've tested this and keep those tests in for more documentation purposes so I'm gonna leave this code in um, although I never broke the code and I'm just gonna get commit push uh, developed is odd let's see if it has reached the github repository so this is the it odd repository is odd repository developed is odd and here is our code so here I showed you how to develop the is odd function in an exemplary way when taking a shortcut and I wish you a very good day bye